Hey, it's me again. So one more thing real quick before we move on and get too much more into the weeds of the campaign builder and examples and, and all of this amazing, amazing stuff that I know like you are totally drooling just like I was when I first saw the campaign builder. But let me show you this because I know that you will need this at some point and I would rather plant the seed now for you to be like, oh yeah, didn't Jillian talk about that? Let me go find that. Um. I'd rather plant that seed now <clears throat> than not show you this and you don't know that it exists. So one of the really cool features of the campaign builder is this little actions tab that a lot of people kind of ignore and don't really like pay a lot of attention to, but it's pretty awesome. So what you can do from here is you can save a version of the campaign. You can, you can create a, a reporting widget based on this campaign and what's in the campaign. You can restore a version of the campaign um, that's been published. You can create a copy of the campaign. But, um, we do this a lot for clients that like make a lot of phone calls to different prospects or clients that run live events that we want to kind of duplicate exactly what we did last time, just tweak it a little bit and like, you know, change the name of the event and change the dates and stuff. We make copies of campaigns all the time. Let's say you want to rename that campaign. You don't want it to say test. You want it to say something more legitimate. You can do that. Um, revert changes is, you know, again, I think it's based on publishing. It would revert whatever changes you made based on the last time that you published the campaign. Um, you can unpublish and delete, which I wouldn't necessarily recommend deleting campaigns. You work so hard to put these together. Unpublish them, fine. If you don't want to use them anymore, cool. Um, but, you know, I'll delete them. You can print a version of the campaign. So let's say you want to actually use the campaign as more of like a mind map and a flow. Uh, you can print a version. You can you can have merge fields. We talked about merge fields. Those are those those boxes where we can save information on a contact um, specific to that individual person. Well, merge fields inside of the campaign builder are fields and, and data points that are specific to that campaign. So the, the, the event thing is a really good example of this. Let's say that you are running a live event and inside of the event, instead of having to change, you know, go into 30 different emails and change the name of the event and change the dates and change like the registration link and, you know, half a dozen other things, you could create all of that stuff inside of merge fields. And then all you have to do when you duplicate the campaign is switch out the merge fields. You know, instead of Dallas, Texas for the event, you would put, I don't know, San Diego. And instead of this link, you would put that link and so on. It's really amazing and it will save you a ton of time. And again, if any of this is over your head, like don't even worry about it. This is purely... Like I'm showing you this so that I can plant that seed um, so that when you do need any of this stuff, you can be like, oh yeah, didn't Jillian talk about that? Yes, that's why we're, we're looking over this. Campaign links, same basic thing as merge fields. Um, I don't really use these if I'm honest. And then locking and exporting, this is specific to me being a, a Keep Certified Partner. Um, if I wanted to like make sure that um, a client couldn't edit a campaign or or if I wanted to make sure that, you know, nobody um, nobody could go in and like touch something that we were in the process of like working on, I could lock the campaign um, or I could export it to, um, they call it the marketplace, but it's the, the strategy guide that we had looked at in the last video. If I wanted to export not specifically the strategy guide, it is the marketplace. Uh, it's, it's a little confusing. But if I wanted to export this campaign so that other people could use it, then I, I can do that as a Keep Certified Partner. But again, you would not see, um, you would not see these two options unless you were a partner as well. But that's what those are. So again, you don't really need to know these. Um, 
They might be a little bit more advanced than what you're looking for, but I want to make sure that you know that this stuff exists.